Adrian in the middle of the pool in lane four. He can Dressel above him. Ryan Hill below him in lane five. Let the adrenaline kind of carry you through this 15, 20 meters, and then guys like Irvin and Jimmy Fegan need to just go after that. Also Olympic spots up for grabs here. The top six make it to the relays in Rio, but right now in the minds of Adrian Dressel and Hell, they want to be the top two. Anthony Irvin up there in lane two, the oldest male swimmer here at the age of 35, had the lead at the turn. Well, he did go, and the problem is, can he maintain that speed? I don't think so, but this guy right in the middle. And Adrian looks like he's gonna win it. Below him is Ryan Held in lane five, going to the wall for second. It's Dressel who joins Adrian in the hundred free. Nathan Adrian makes his third Olympic team, and he'll have a chance. <laughs> to defend that gold. Anthony Irvin finished fourth. And how about Ryan Held getting third? The no-name comes out of nowhere to get in there and make his team. Ultimate performance of the day presented by BMW, and we just saw it in this electric 100 free final in which Nathan Adrian held off the upstarts, Caleb Dressel and Ryan Held, but it was Dressel who finished second to get that other spot. Rock, watch him right there. You could just see that lunge to the wall, barely getting in there. That's three one hundredths of a second over Ryan Held right there. But boy, Nathan Adrian did the job. That's the second fastest time in the world this year. This ultimate performance of the day brought to you by BMW, the ultimate driving machine. Lots of storylines swirling in this final, including the Olympic rings by Anthony Irvin's name again. He tied for a gold as a 19-year-old 16 years ago in the 53 in Sydney, and he's on his way to his third Olympic team. But Nathan Adrian will have that chance to defend, and there's mom and dad, his biggest supporters, watching their son get it done again at the age of 27.